इकोनॉमिक्स क्लास इलेवन चैप्टर नाइन मेजर ऑफ सेल्टन टेंडेंसी पार्ट ट्वेल्व क्वार्टाइल एंड मिसिंग वैल्यूज कैलकुलेट मिसिंग वैल्यूज फ्रॉम फॉलोइंग वेन क्यू वन इक्वल्स ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड क्यू थ्री इक्वल्स फिफ्टी एज यू आर ऑब्जर्विंग द मार्क्स आर गिवेन फ्रॉम जीरो टिल सेवेंटी टू एट्टी बट द फ्रीक्वेंसीज आर एट सिक्सटीन दैट इज मिसिंग थर्टी एट दैन मिसिंग ट्वेंटी टेन एंड दैन मिसिंग सो वी विल एज्यूम इट एट एक्स वाई एंड जेड एंड लेट एस एज्यूम मिसिंग वैल्यूज एन एक्स वाई एंड जेड सो द क्लास इंटरवल विल बी गिवेन एज एट सिक्सटीन X thirty eight Y twenty ten Z. Now we will make the cumulative frequency eight plus sixteen twenty four twenty four plus X that is twenty four plus X twenty four plus thirty eight that is sixty two plus X then sixty two plus X plus Y then sixty two plus twenty that is eighty two plus X plus Y eighty two plus ten that is ninety two plus X plus Y and the last value is also missing so it will be ninety two plus X plus Y plus Z and n is given as one forty four so the summation of all this X Y and Z will be equal to one forty four minus ninety two that is fifty two so when the Q Q one or the lower quartile is given as twenty five, which is lying in twenty to thirty because it should lie in the particular range. By interpolating twenty five equals twenty plus one forty four by four, that is n by four minus twenty four, that is the cumulative frequency just before the quartile class upon x into thirty minus twenty. Twenty five. Minus twenty equals thirty six minus twenty four upon x into ten. Then five x will be equal to one twenty because twelve into ten that is one twenty and one twenty over five we will be getting the value of x. Now the y and z are remaining. Similarly, Q three is given as fifty, so it will be lying in fifty to sixty because the values from fifty to fifty nine will be counted in fifty to sixty class. Q three equals L one plus three n by four minus c upon f into L two minus L one. Fifty equals fifty plus hundred and eight. How it this hundred and eight? Thirty six multiplied by three, as you can see here. Then hundred and eight minus sixty two plus x plus y upon twenty into sixty minus fifty. Fifty equals fifty plus hundred and eight minus sixty two minus x minus y because when the values come out of the sign changes upon twenty into ten, then fifty minus fifty upon equals hundred and eight minus sixty two minus x minus y upon two. Zero into two means there will be cross multiplication. Fifty minus fifty that will equal to zero. Forty six minus x minus y and already we have calculated. Twenty-four as x, so it will the value of y will be twenty-two. X plus y plus z equals fifty-two. Twenty-four plus twenty-two plus z equals fifty-two, and we will be getting fifty-two minus forty-six. That is six.